Now my answer might surprise you, but do you know how much time it took for a non-technical guy like me to create Elementor WordPress websites like this one or this one or maybe this one? Just three minutes. Yeah, you heard it right. Just three minutes and sometimes even less than that. And all I did was added free Elementor plugin along with another plugin which actually supercharged my WordPress website with a lot of free amazing Elementor templates. And the plugin is Starter Templates. So what exactly is Starter Templates? It's a free plugin that comes with hundreds of free Elementor website templates that you can simply import in your WordPress setup and create fully functional WordPress websites in just a few clicks. In this plugin, you will be able to find templates for almost any kind of website that you wish to build. But if in case you don't find the exact match, you will surely be able to find one which is very close to what you are trying to build. Then you can simply import that in your WordPress setup and then you can use the free drag and drop page builder that is Elementor to customize your WordPress website as per your needs. Sounds interesting, isn't it? Then in this video, let me show you how easy it is to build your complete WordPress website in just a few clicks using starter templates. And just to give you an idea about how versatile this starter template library is, we are going to showcase different website templates that you can use to create your next WordPress website, maybe for yourself or maybe for your next client project. Because in Starter Template Library, we have something for everyone. So first, let's go ahead and set up the Starter Template plugin in our WordPress site. So here we are in our WordPress backend and here in Appearance section, under Themes, here we have added the Astra theme which we always recommend because we all know it's fast, it's fully customizable and you can create any kind of WordPress website with just this theme. So it's time to install our required plugins. So we go to plugins section and here we will click on add new and the first plugin we need to add is Elementor. So we will search for Elementor here and here is the Elementor website builder. So we are going to use only the free version of this plugin. So let's click on install now and then click on activate. Once that is done, let's click on add new once again. And this time we are going to search our starter template plugin. So let's type in starter templates. And here is our starter templates plugin, which is made by brainstorm force team. So let's install this now and then click on activate. And now here we need to select what type of page builder we are going to use for creating our WordPress site. So we can use either block editor, Elementor or Beaver builder. But for this video, we are only going to concentrate on Elementor. So let's click on this. And here we have our entire library of starter templates that we can use with Elementor page builder to create our full WordPress website. So if we scroll down, we can see we have a lot of options available here and using all these templates, we can create almost any type of website. Now, along with these free starter templates, we also have premium templates as well, which you will be able to access once you upgrade to the premium plans of Astra. But for now, we are only going to use the free templates. So using these free Elementor starter templates, we can create some outdoor adventure site, an e-commerce website, or maybe a personal portfolio site, website for a politician, maybe a restaurant site, and the list goes on and on. So let me first show you some different example of website templates that you can use. So let's begin with our template number one for creating a business website. So for creating a business website, we already have a category right here. So if we click on this business category, we will now see all the templates under this category. So we can go ahead and scroll down and see which one looks best for our requirement. So let's say you want to build a digital agency website. So here is a template for that. Let's click on this to see the preview. So here we have a quick preview of this template here. Along with that, we can also upload our logo using this option here so that we can have a good idea about how the template will look with our branding on it. So as you can see, we have this very clean, professional looking website. And as this is for a digital agency, on the very home page, we have all the different services offered by the business. And if we scroll down, we also have a portfolio section, which is a very important section for a digital agency site. And below that, we can also add our customer's logo and the testimonials as well. And if we scroll down more, we have the team section. And at the very bottom, we have a very clean looking footer as well. And this is just the home page. We also have various other pages for this template, like about us, 
our services and the very important contact page and under our business category templates this is just one example as you can see for the business category itself we have a long list of templates here that you can choose from next template we have is for portfolio websites so if you are someone who wish to create a website to showcase your professional services then these templates are just for you so once again if you come back here in our template library we have a separate section for personal sites as well and once we click on this here we can see the list of different personal website templates that we can choose from. So let's say you are a photographer and you want to build a personal portfolio website to offer your photography services. Here we have a template for that as well. So if you click on this, so here we have a quick preview. And once again, we can use our logo file to see how exactly it's going to look with our brand identity. And once again, as you can see, we have a very clean and professional design. We have a big call to action button right on the top of the site, which is a phone number in this case. So you definitely want people to call you for book your services. So we definitely need to highlight the phone number so that people can call you for your services. And just below that, we have a very clean hero section. And if we scroll down, you can see the consistency of the design continues with some high quality images, which is a must for a photography portfolio site. And if we scroll down more, here we have a section for all the services that you can offer. And if we scroll down, we also have a section for awards. And below that, we have a unique testimonial section as well. And at the very bottom, we have few more images from the portfolio. And once again, we have clearly mentioned the phone number here, which your visitors can use to book your services. And once again, we have about page as well as a blog page for this template, which you can use as a base to create more pages for your website. Next template we have for the showcase is for creating e-commerce websites. And once again, in our starter template library, we have a separate section for our e-commerce templates. So now if we click on this, we can see the complete list of e-commerce websites that we can create using these templates. So maybe you want to build a plant shop or maybe you will have some organic products that you want to sell online. So we have template for almost every category. So let's take the example of organic store. So if we click on this, so here we have this e-commerce template preview. And once again, we have very clean design with some eye catching hero section where we have showcased the product images. And just below that, we have some important badges, which are very important for any e-commerce website. And below that, we have our best selling product section. And below that, we have a very clean design for different categories. And of course, for offering discount codes, we have a clear call to action for that as well. Now, as you will be using Astra theme along with the starter template plugin, we have a lot of features in Astra, which you can use to create some amazing looking e-commerce sites. To learn more about all these features, make sure you watch this video right here. So we will leave a link in the i button above and we will add a link in the video description below. And I'm sure you will love all the e-commerce features that Astra offers. Next template for showcase we have for creating services websites. And here in our starter template library, we can choose the template from local business. So there are a lot of services that you might be offering and we have different category templates for that. So here, let's say we want to build a website for an electrician. So if you go in the local business section here, we have a category for electrician site. So if we click on this, here we have a template for electrician and for AC technician as well and a lot of other similar templates that you can choose from. So for this example, let's say we go with electrician template and here right on the home page, we have a big hero section with a request to call back form, which is a must for this kind of website because lead generation is your first priority. If we scroll down, once again, we have a very clean design and we have various sections to showcase all your different services. And if once we scroll down at the very bottom, we again have a request a code form here and right at the bottom we have a clean footer with a google map which is once again very important for any local service provider and once again we have various other pages for this service website and we also have an option to add phone number right on the top of your website so that it will be clearly visible on the very top of the website and your visitors can instantly call you to book your services. Now next template for showcase is for building personal blogs. And once again, in the starter template library, we have a separate section for blogs. And once we click on this, we will be able to see all the beautiful design templates that we have for creating a blog website. 
So here, let's say you want to build a recipe blog. So here we have a template for that. So if we click on this, here we can see we have a big hero section with a video playing in the background. And if you are building a recipe blog, then I'm sure you want to feature your videos here. And if we scroll down here, we have a about section where you can put up the bloggers bio here. And below that we have a recipe section. So here you can feature your recent or most popular recipes. And we also have a testimonial section just in case you want it. And after that, we have a call to action button, which you can link to your newsletter subscription. And the most important part of these templates is the blog section. So if you click on this, here we have a very eye catching design for showcasing your recipes or any kind of blog. So here we have some blogs that you can feature like this, or maybe we can create a feature section like this one. Here we again have a different style of showcasing your recipes. And below that, we have the third style for showcasing your recipe blogs. Now, these are just a few examples. As you can see, we have a huge template library here that you can use for any kind of WordPress website. Now, if all this already looks exciting to you, let me show you how fast and easy it is to import any template that you like into your WordPress setup and how easy it is to edit any section of this template using Elementor Page Builder. So let's say you have a cafe and you want to build a website for that. So let's see how we can do that. Here we have a coffee house template for that as well. So if we click on this, here we can see the live preview of the site, how exactly it's going to look. And here we can see a professionally designed page with some amazing looking typography and images. And on the left hand side, before even importing this template, you can upload your logo here and you can get a feel of how this template is going to look with your own logo. And in order to import this starter template in our WordPress setup, all we have to do is just click on skip and continue. And here we got an option to choose the desired color palette. So the default one is already selected here and we can choose any other color palette as our requirement. But right now for a coffee house website, we can select this color scheme. And if we scroll down, we can do the same for fonts as well. So here we can test out all these fonts and we can see the live preview here itself. But we are going to stick with the default one here and then just click on continue. And on this screen, you just need to fill up your basic details. And we can also opt in for the newsletter to get updated with the latest design trends and with all the updates related to the starter template library. Below this, we have an advanced option as well. Here we can choose what exactly we need to import in our website. So we will highly recommend that you leave everything as it is so that you can get the maximum out of this starter template and customize everything later on. So let's click on this button, submit and build my website. And now it's going to take a few seconds to do all the things in the back end and import our starter template. And boom, now our website is ready to use. It took only 13 seconds to import everything in our WordPress setup. And now we are ready to access our website. For that, we just need to click on this button here. So let's click on view your website. So it's going to open up our site in a new tab. And here we can see the entire template imported in our WordPress setup. And now we can simply edit everything using the Elementor drag and drop page builder. And we can customize both of our header and footer using the Astra theme customization. But in order to customize any content of our website or the page that we have here, we will be using the free Elementor page builder plugin. So for that, we have again two options. We can simply click on edit with Elementor from here and it will take us to the Elementor page builder editor. Or from our WordPress backend, we can go to pages and here we have our home page. Let's click on edit. And now we can click on edit with Elementor. And now we are inside the Elementor page builder editor. And here we can simply use all these widgets to add new elements on our page. Or if you want, we can simply change any text or element on this page. Like here on this text, we can simply click on this and start typing to customize it as per our requirement. Or let's say we want to change this background image here. So we can simply click on this main section here, go to style and here we can see our background image. So we can replace this. Let's upload a new image. So here's the image that we have added from our computer. Let's select this. And now we have an entirely different image in the background. 
Now, along with the background, we can play around with background overlay. So maybe we can play around with the opacity here, or maybe we can change the color as well. So if we turn this a little bit dark, so this is how it's going to look. So here you can click on any of these elements and you will be able to edit that. And once you are done, you can simply click on update and this will save all the changes. And after that, we simply need to refresh the front end and we will be able to see the changes we have done. So these are some of the best Elementor templates that you can use for your next WordPress project and create a fully functional WordPress website in just a few clicks. And if you want to learn more about Astra theme, how you can set it up, how you can customize and how you can build an entire website using Astra, make sure you watch this video right here for the full in-depth tutorial. We will also leave a link in the i button above and the video description below. And for more WordPress videos like this, make sure you subscribe to this channel and hit the notification bell so that you can get notified whenever we upload our next video. That's it for this one and I'll see you in the next video.